Okay, regarding periodic and a periodic signal, in data communications, we commonly use periodic analog signals and a periodic digital signals to send data. Okay, next, uh, let's see what is amplitude or peak amplitude, frequency and uh, phase. So, the most fundamental form of a periodic analog signal okay, uh, is a sine wave. Okay, uh, basic asas untuk periodic signal adalah sine wave. A sine wave can be represented by three parameters, peak amplitude or sometimes we call it amplitude only, frequency and phase. So, apakah itu amplitude, frequency and phase? Okay, okay refer to this figure. Okay, this is a graph, okay, amplitude versus time. Okay, amplitude versus time. So, as you can see here, the height of the wave is 5. Okay, amplitude usually in volt. Unit untuk amplitude kebiasaannya adalah volt, voltan. So, kita akan tulis sebagai V only. And then, uh, okay, if you refer to this figure, okay, the time from here to here is 1 second. Okay. Ini adalah graf amplitude melawan masa dan masa biasanya unit dia adalah second. Okay. So amplitude adalah ketinggian uh, peak ni. Ketinggian the height of the peak. Okay. In this figure the amplitude is 5. Okay. Similarly for this one. Okay. Next frequency. What is frequency? Okay, frequency adalah how many times uh, the wave complete uh, a cycle. Okay, berapa banyak uh, how many times the wave complete a full cycle within one second. Berapa kali a signal tu uh, complete Satu full cycle dalam masa satu saat. Okay, contohnya, okay, how you calculate from here to here. Okay, ni satu cycle. Satu, dua, tiga, empat. Okay, so there are four cycles completed by this wave within one second. Ada empat cycle, empat complete cycle dalam satu saat. So that's why frequency Four. Okay, so you don't have to bother about the uh, equation. Yang equation ni tak perlu. Okay, just focus to this A and F for the time being. A and F only. Okay, what happened? Okay, second one. This one F equal to two. Frequency. Frequency equal to two. What does it mean? Okay, kita tengok berapa kali dia complete satu cycle. Uh, cycle. Berapa, berapa kali signal ni complete full cycle dalam masa satu saat. Okay, since dia, set, dia mula dekat puncak ni, it start at the at the peak, okay. So, we have to consider from the peak to the peak also. One, two. So, this uh, wave complete two cycles within one second. So, that's why frequency is two. Okay. So, we try to see the definition first. Okay, the amplitude is the height of the wave above or below a given reference point. Reference point ni adalah garis, uh, sorry, horizontal as this ni. Okay, so ketinggian diukur daripada reference point ni ke atas ataupun ke bawah itu adalah amplitude. Okay, so samalah kalau ke atas ni positif 5, ke bawah ni minus 5. Okay. That is amplitude normally measured in volts, voltan. So peak amplitude means the absolute value of its highest intensity proportional to energy it's carry. Okay. Uh, second one, period and frequency. Okay, period. What does it mean by period? Means amount of time in seconds. A signal needs to complete one cycle. Masa yang diambil untuk completekan satu cycle. Okay. Okay. So, dia tulis sebagai T. Period. Okay. 
Ini adalah satu period. Daripada sini ke sini satu period. Yang ni pun satu period. Okay. So frequency number of periods in one second measured in hertz. Okay. Frekuensi dalam hertz ataupun kita panggil juga cycles per second. Usually hertz. Period and frequency are inverse of each other. Okay. So you have to know this formula. F equal to 1 over T. T equal to 1 over F. So as you can see from this figure, you have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 cycles within 1 second. So meaning that the frequency is 6 hertz. Okay, 6 hertz. Okay, then period. Period can be calculated as 1 over F. So, frekuensi dia kita dapat 6. So, kita nak tahu period dia ialah T equal to 1 over 6. Unit dia dalam second. 